everybody, it's Khalif PvP bringing you another Black Desert video. This time I'm bringing you a class overview guide. Uh, this is not a class guide where I'm going to teach you how to play the class. This is actually a guide pertaining to how a class plays out. So this is really useful for those of you that haven't played Black Desert, don't know what class to play. Hopefully by the end of this guide you have a basic understanding of what the Blader class plays like what other MMO classes it's similar to, etc. So let's get started. So let's talk about the Blader skill list. A lot of the Blader skills are very fast moving skills. The flip side of this is that because it's so fast moving, it doesn't feel as if there's any weight behind it. For example, take the, the Giant class. Uh, a lot of the Giant skills, you can see that there's this weight behind each of its attack when the axe hits you can kind of feel that the opponent is getting hit with a giant axe um, when the, a lot of the skills leave behind like the shockwave like effect even though it's an effect um, it, it, it gives the player kind of this idea that it, there's damage being done right whereas the blader it kind of more like slicing through things so if you know it, it does fit into the blader class but you know, some people might be interested in something that's more uh, heavy. The Blader is not a heavy class. It's more, it's very nimble, very fast. Uh, supple things with the classes are you have four skills, four or five actually, that leave behind what we call a tornado. And what this tornado does is, let's see if I can pull it up. Uh, what this tornado does is it damages the opponent for a very brief seconds, about like two seconds or so. Uh, not only does it damage, it usually knocks the opponent up and knocks them down after the end of the tornado. So there's a couple skills. One skill, pretty hard to pull off in PvP, it's on your left and right uh, that leaves behind a tornado. The next skill is more of a frontal immediate melee tornado that you can pull off. The other one is a very, very uh, bread and butter of all, all bladers, I would say, is this uh, water sprout. It's a 360 AoE tornado that you'll do again you can see from the little video you knock the opponent up and knock them down as well and finally to branch off of that you have another one that shoots off a tornado in a straight line in front of you uh, it's I would say it's about short to medium distance on that one so combo wise as the kind of the the video in the front of the character selection screen has shown blader does have a lot of combos that you can pull off uh, a lot of hidden combos that i'll cover in the blader specific guide but let's look at a little, little skill guide you have a couple of the advanced ones are really what's worth it a lot of these are even though on the the character creation it says you know i think the difficulty is quite high i really think it's not that hard to pull off these combos uh especially if you've played you know, action MMOs prior. So you see me play the Blader for a little bit. So how does it compare to other classes? How, how does it actually feel in terms of uh, other classes from other MMOs, for example? Because most of you are probably not playing Black Desert right now and you want to get a general feel for the class feel. I would make the comparison to the play style. So I want to preface this in saying that this isn't one-to-one -one comparisons. I'm not saying that if you play this class, it's gonna the blader is going to play exactly like you know the class that you're playing in such and such MMO. So please don't you know reply on the comments say what blader doesn't play like this class. Um, I'm just merely giving you a feel as to how how it, the blader would play. How we how we would feel to play the blader class. So. The first comparison I would make is the Blader is very similar to the Reaper class in Terra Online in terms of the playstyle. It's very fast, very moving, a lot of positional uh, skills. Um, the next one is also the, um, from Terra Online, Warrior class. So if you play the Warrior, uh, again, very fast hitting class, very quick class. Um, minus the low tankiness of the Warrior, I don't think the Blader is as tanky as the Warrior in Terra is. Uh, from Elder Scrolls Online, I would say a dual wield Nightblade. Um, I think it was a fair comparison in terms of fast hitting uh, skills. From Guild Wars 2, I would say it's more aligned with a sword dagger uh, thief without the backstab. So think of a sword dagger thief 
uh, without a backstab. So maybe dagger sword will be my might be a better uh, comparison. Uh, think about that. Uh, and that's kind of how the play feel is. So if you enjoy playing any of those classes that I mentioned, uh, I think you'll also enjoy uh, playing the blader in Black Desert. So that pretty much wraps it up my you know class guide class uh, you know overview guide rather not the guide. Um, if, let me know what you guys think. Uh, if you wanted me to talk about something different, uh, if you like what I put, but, uh, if you have any questions, please feel to comment on the video and let me know what else you wanted me to talk about.